How do you officer shame? Can he say? Can you say it? Mr. Patton, please. Come on. Been around the world twice. Talked to everyone once. There ain't nothing I can't do. No sky too high, no sea too rough. But a lot of lessons in my life. Never shoot a large caliber man with a small caliber bullet. Anything in life worth doing is worth overdoing. Moderation's for cowards. I'm a lover, I'm a fighter, I'm a UDT Navy SEAL diver. Listen up, Red Wing's a go. Tonight, 1800. Operation Red Wing was a plan through an area of northern Afghanistan to clean out terrorists. Going in with a four-man team, Axelson, myself, Dietz, Marcus. The primary objective was just to find this Taliban leader, but they got there and many things start going wrong. Go! 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 This op is compromised. The way I see it, we got two options. One, let them go, roll the dice. The second that they run down there, we got 200 on our backs. Two, we terminate the compromise. We cannot do that out here. I care about you. I care about you. I care about you. It was the dilemma that these guys were faced with. There really was no easy answer. This is not a vote. We're going to cut them loose, and we're going home. Roger that, sir. Roger. You see this? We're fixing to get into a pretty good gunfight. The actors knew they had a responsibility to capture that warrior spirit that these men had. I took a fall. The chest came up over my hips and I started flipping. As the sun came up, I had had enough. And I was just like, I'll just engage till they kill me. Marcus has dedicated his life since this happened to telling this story to as many people as you can. It's about right, and then I went this way. When I started doing the speaking tours, that was to keep the memory of my teammates alive. He believes the reason he survived is to make sure people remember who these guys were and how they died. He was gonna make sure I understood what happened on that mountain. What is the common denominator that makes someone willing to stick it out? What it all boils down to is the willingness to give your life to make it through something and the others won't. And I asked some of the SEALs, do you get scared? And they said, our greatest fear is not being there for each other. That's all they care about. Oh! Oh! Daddy, let's go! Get him up! When we come up on the guns, we start firing. I'm not firing my weapon to protect myself. I'm firing my weapon to protect you. We surround each other, protect each other, look out for each other, and, and, and that's when you know you're gonna make it. Ready! Go, go, go! Marcus, move! I will have your back. I will be there for you. I will do everything I can, including give my life for you. Let's move! We're good, right? We're solid. No matter how many times I got up and told that story or how many people read that book, it's nothing compared to how many people will watch that film. So my job is done. Mission complete. Just for one day. Hey, LT. Is that redhead a bridesmaid? That's Melissa. Is she coming? She's a bridesmaid. Yeah. Is she coming? She's a bridesmaid. Yes. What did she ask about me? Bad guy. Senior Taliban commander. Shaw killed 20 Marines last week. We let him go. 40 more will die next week. A lot more than 10 guys. That's an army. Let's fall back to that tree line. This op is compromised. We got two options. One, we let them go. The second that they run down there, we got Taliban on our backs. Two, we terminate the compromise. Not feeling it, not killing kids. I think we did the right thing. Isn't that how things work? Good things happen, good people? We're fixing to get into a pretty good gunfight. Do it. Let's move! Let's really move! Let's go! Shot me. We're all shot broken, you fight? I can fight. I can fight! 